reacts. Testing, testing, one, two, three, and we are live. What's up, guys? George the Cloud here. My name is Jorge, aka George. Welcome to the channel and welcome to my live Alpha Veil Forever Young official video. Let's go. No, I'm just kidding. Hold up. Hold up. Before we get right into it, um, I welcome you to the channel. Of course, this is a new segment that I like to call Back to the 80s. And we basically go back to the 1980s, the best decade of music and maybe of everything. Uh, well, everything everywhere all at once is that the name of the that movie that won like every award for the um, the grammys no not the grammys the grammys is music the oscars <laughs> but yeah um alpha bill i think i only know this song from them to be honest and it's a great song uh vocals on point we're gonna get you know right into it but uh I don't think I can recall any other song from Alphaville, so you guys let me know. I think I, I've started to ask this question in every um, video from this segment of the 1980s. Are they a one-hit wonder, would you say? Would you consider or think about? I'm not sure. I'm not going to say yes or no. I'll uh, make my decision after I read the comments, but for now, we're just going to get right into it. Enjoy it. I think this is a song that has been sampled a lot by different artists but in general people don't really seem to play the original or I don't know just never hear this song ever I mean of course we're not gonna appear on the radio in 2024 you know 24 7 but still it's just it's kind of amazing that it's been flying under the, the radar unless you know it and uh, just right before I played it, uh, play the song, I think I'm gonna start doing this now. Just looking up uh, the about. So, um, album Forever Young, artist Forever Young. I mean, I <laughs> already already failing at my. I had one job, guys. Artist Alpha Bill, album Forever Young, song Forever Young, released 1984. 1984 to me the best year of music ever i did some research during the pandemic and went through all the years every year of music back until the 50s and i think 1984 is the best year of music genres synth pop new wave rock okay good to know i'm learning i'm gonna start learning so i can be a scholar when i grow up Get some popcorn, fill up your water, put your headphones on, on, on. Let's go. Thank you. 
so many comments guys first of all why is there a picture of a sad cat being recommended here out of nowhere anyway first things first we like and we subscribe i have a link of the original video down in the description below so you can check it out and support the creators oh okay this is the cap capu 22 is the person that posted the the original somebody let me know what what's going on here where is the official Alphaville YouTube channel? This video was posted by a, a cat and it is apparently the official video and has been accepted as such. So interesting there. Not sure what happened with the original band. Wow. Wow, am I surprised that I remembered almost all the lyrics of this song that I haven't heard in months, maybe years. See, this is why I love the 80s. The songs are so memorable and have been played so much. They are deep inside inside our brains, at least mine. And I can't even do that with a song from nowadays, like a modern song that, you know, comes out in 2024, 2023, whatever. It's just, I don't know, I don't catch onto the lyrics as much. But this one, it's so memorable. Maybe because the lyrics are so clear and he sings them like really almost like opera i don't know for some reason while i was you know looking at that th there's so many points to make and that's the thing about the doing my um, type of reaction videos that i don't keep pausing the video every 10 seconds that's annoying i don't like to do that and i, I don't enjoy the song so i just wait for the end and unwrap everything so what happened, let me know guys in the comments since you are the experts, what happened to this singer? What's his name? Where did he go? What other songs have they done? Because to me, this is a very impressive voice that he has. And I don't say that lightly. I mean, this is bordering Freddie Mercury, that singer from Journey, high pitched but strong, a very... um consistent tone very like why why haven't we not heard of him more or maybe it's just me but i don't know it just feels like uh like the potential wasn't reached with this band or at least the singer because i like again i only know this song and his voice is outstanding so i thought the song was playing so i'm not sure what happened there let me know so this music video is strange i never i've never seen the music video for this song before i don't think so this is kind of odd almost like it was taken from a movie or something the way these people are dressed are somewhere in between like hobbits <laughs> lord of the rings and uh what's that movie alice in wonderland from like the 1930s strange one thing i want to point out here is that right at this part when you know all the singing is done the intro we're getting into the climax of the song let's just listen all right so right there in that part usually in a rock song this would go into a, an electric guitar or something similar but in this situation they decided to go with this synth sound that's uh sounds sorry to be redundant sounds like trumpets right i don't think these are real trumpets it just um looks more to be like synth but it's interesting how they made that choice and i think that's what sets apart this song that it doesn't have really a strong guitar acoustic or electric the the drums are there drums are heavy but it's mostly his voice followed by this synth and of course that's the genre of music this is but um it's still 
great because it it's more memorable it stands out and like i said i don't think i would have like typically you would expect the guitar to start playing and not this synth kind of replacing it and this video going along with like uh i don't know some sort of 80s extraterrestrial otherworldly interdimensional matrix kind of thing that's going on here not sure but this is an odd music video this is an odd music video they're just playing it's it's just like the band playing the song at points and then at other is like this group of people that look like they came out of paintings from 500 years ago going into this rhombus of of eternal youth maybe <laughs> that's what it is i need to, i need to get there somebody tell me what the just send me the address and I'll look it up in GPS how to how to get to the, to this shape of infinite youth. But yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the reaction. I think uh, I'll stop there because it is quite long and most people leave the video at around three or four minutes, which is actually disturbing. Of course, sad, disappointing, but uh, above all, disturbing. So what the heck? If you like this, hit the like, subscribe, share, ring the bell even, um, and join join to support me and to watch me do this full time at some point and at the end do a flip till the next thanks for watching